Give me a check and I fuck it up. Give me a check and I fuck it up. Give me a check and I fuck it up. Yo, wish boy. Gotta fight back with another reaction. We got when his pregnant girlfriend passed loyalty death. Right, I know I've been gone for like ten days. I've been trying to get shit right. But uh, we back. Like how so I share the video and nigga, let's get to it. Uh, let me know some videos to react to too, cause I've been gone for a minute. Let me know in the comments, bro. All right, dude, how you feeling? Cool, cool, this cool. Awesome. You ready for this, man? Yeah, you gotta be ready, man. Mm -hmm. About to put her ass to this test. She got me in the blender. I'm trying to figure out what the f*** going on. Nah, right I see. She got me in the blender. And I feel it. Today, we're replacing Jozark's pregnant girlfriend, Sierra, to the test. Will she remain loyal to him, or will he she treat him for another rich and successful guy? So, Damn. So what y'all think it's dang? You wouldn't be here. Oh, not at all. Not at all. I'm just gonna find me another one. <laughs> Guys, I'm about to open the door right now. I'm about to let you in. Yo! This loyalty test will take place at this million dollar home. Our friend Isaiah is pretending that he lives here. Madeline will convince Sierra to come over, and when the time is right, Isaiah will ask her on a date, allowing Jozar to find out if she will remain loyal. So she hits you up saying that she's pregnant, mm. and it's yours. She's saying it's mine, but you know. You don't think it's yours? It ain't no evidence proving that. Yeah. Damn. Together. But you know, we trying to solidify everything with the trust. So, you know, we making it work for now. Being for, there for the kid is what's most important. Yeah. For sure. Okay. If she loyal, then I'll apply myself to the situation as a whole. We really be thinking that, like, we be dumb, though, sometimes. Like, no, but at the same time, them bitches be sneaky. Well, the they be sneaky. Make it work, but if not, then I'm going to just keep going on about my way. Shit. My girl says she's pregnant, but I don't think it's mine because she'd be outside too much. Oh, oh. Issues in the past. Then, yeah, never mind. <laughs> I was about to say, if she be with you most of the time, it's probably yours, gang. But if she be outside a lot, it's a different story. So let's set up a test on her. That yeah. was the crazy DM that Jozar sent. And after hitting him up and learning more, we found out that he makes music and she's a dancer. They met while working together. They dated for a year and then they broke up the entertainment industry as a whole you know as both of us being involved with different aspects of music and dancing it ain't really work out you know trust and everything wasn't really right. working out so gotcha. we decided Hell to just nah. break it off gotcha a couple months after breaking up though Jozar and sierra would reconnect on a night out i was doing my one two for like four months and i caught her in the club again we made our connection but we kept it platonic after that and she hit me up like a month later and said she had a baby so it was like and it's yours She's saying this, mom, but you know. You don't think it's yours? It ain't no evidence proving that. It's all hypothetical, because, you know, we did have our consensuals, but she could have been doing that with anybody. And at the end of the day, I caught her at the club, so you know how I get when you out enjoying yourself. I was just probably her option for that night. I'm just trying to make sure that it wasn't others before me. After telling him that she was pregnant, Sierra told Jozart that they should try to work things out between them, that they should try to be a family for the baby's sake, and Jozart's down for that, if the baby is his. She came back into your life, and and said, I got a baby, and I want to make this How? Work. What did you say to her when she said that? Really? Sure? <laughs> that's the first thing, of course. Right. Uh, are you sure? And then, is it mine? But you know, that's kind of always going to throw the situation left and into the bad light when you accuse her of. Yeah. We together, but you know, we trying to solidify everything with the trust. So, you know, we making it work for now. <laughs> Right. Jozart and Sierra initially broke up because of trust issues, so of course there's going to be doubts. Hopefully those doubts go away, though, with this loyalty test. And I'm not going to lie, I was very hesitant about doing this video, primarily because there's an innocent third party involved. We went through with everything, though, because Jozart said he'd be there for the kid, whether Sierra stayed loyal or not. If, of course, the baby is his. Co-parenting is always the better option. But, depending on how far do she is, you can now get... Can you? Can't you get blood test? See if the baby's yours? Early? Like, it doesn't have to be born, right? Am I wrong? Y'all niggas might know. But I'm pretty sure you can't do that, though. Option with I'm pretty sure. Being for, there for the kids if not, I'm just making forth. up so shit. If she stays loyal, what happens then? If she loyal, then I'll apply myself to the situation. But until then, she on thin ice. What's she look like, though? Hey girl, uh, I just wanted to make sure that we're still on for today to go over choreo. Yeah, I'm still good for it. Okay, perfect. I'm gonna head over to the producer's house soon. I'll send you my ATA. 
Okay, see you soon. See you soon. The first step of her plan was getting Sierra to come to this house. So yeah. a couple days ago, we had Madeline ask her to create some dance choreography for one of her songs in exchange for some good money. Sierra was interested and even suggested meeting at a dance studio. Okay, I was about to say, how did you However, get that? as planned, Madeline preferred to meet at her producer's house. Hey, this is nice. This is crazy. They got the rabbit fur carpet. It's crazy. <laughs> Shoot, I feel like I can get used to this. She gonna see this car and that's gonna let me know right there. From She's the gonna get the full test right now. She's gonna get the full <laughs> test. The million dollar home is gonna make Isaiah look rich, but this $475,000 Rolls Royce is going to add some crazy credibility. Here's Call my feature. Bloop. Whoa! Fucking umbrella. That, how much is this umbrella? 3200 3200 3200 For a fucking umbrella. You got me fucked up. I will buy a bitch from Walmart. I go buy that bitch from Walmart. I'm motherfucking... That shit does the same thing. Unless that bitch making you fly. Hundred dollars. I'm about to be like, hey, how much is the car? How much you think this umbrella is? That's the flex. I think you can film a gold digger video with just the umbrella. Bro. <laughs> the owner of this umbrella and the Rolls Royce is our friend Kyle. Today he'll be playing Isaiah's driver. After showing Isaiah how to work the car, setting everything up, and adjusting our plan a bit because of the rain, everyone eventually got into position. So you said you already have baby mama drum? Yeah, I got two kids already. How's it going? Oh, you shit. Baby mama. They pretty cool now, you know. <laughs> Yeah, he's not trying to add another one to the list. Be, I see why he's doing this shit. First, this know, is the, the only reason why. About it is they let me see my kids and talk That's to my good. kids. How do you drive this car? This is half a million dollars? You can drive it after afterwards. I don't think you want me to drive it. <laughs> you see the color of my skin, bro? <laughs> <laughs> what? what the fuck that supposed to mean? Hello? Oh, is this it? I think what, this what is it. What the fuck it. is that supposed okay, to mean? perfect. Um, I have parking in the driveway for you. I just found some street parking. Like super just park in the driveway because I don't want you to get towed. They usually start towing cars around four. Oh, really? Just pull into the driveway. I'm coming out right now. Where is that her? She's right there, yeah. Okay, we're starting, we're starting, we're starting. Madeline had to convince Sierra to park in the driveway. Okay. I'm trying to see what she... Right now. Do you I see me? Oh, okay, bad. Cool. Let's hey. pull up right here. Right there. That right here? Yeah. There we go. She's parking in the driveway. Perfect. This was a simple but important task. You guys will see Dodge how to use advantage later. Nice to finally meet you. How was the drive? Oh, actually not too bad. Thank God it stopped raining. Okay, here we go. The shot begins. I forgot they don't show their faces. They got nut ass emojis and shit over these niggas' faces, bruh. There's so much work to do, but yeah. One thing at a time. Yeah. You know? That should be killing me. Um, we could just, I already set up the mirror here. I was thinking we just do here. Oh. This is the producer. Hey. How's it going? Isaiah. All right, they met. First contact. Uh, if you want to just put your stuff down, yeah. we. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Madeline now had to make this entire thing believable. So before they start working on the dance choreo for her song, she makes small talk with Sierra, all while Isaiah pretends to get work done. We could do like something for TikTok, something pretty short. It doesn't have to be like super, you know, like crazy yeah. you know yeah. i mean we could just start get into it we yeah. could just eventually the girls move on to creating the choreo yeah we're just gonna give them some time here to do their thing and then i'm gonna be giving madeline a call and getting her out of the scene i got legends watching me get done dirty that's crazy <laughs> <laughs> i was like what the fuck are you talking about right now watching this <laughs> <laughs> bro funny as fuck have you ever owned a honda civic yes i have a honda civic okay, okay. I that was a dumbass question I'm pretty sure everybody in a lifetime had a fucking Honda. For real. Had to. I mean, don't get me wrong, them bitches reliable. Oh, just like they probably actually more reliable than this Rolls Royce. Say I'm lying. You put motherfucking about 180 miles on that motherfucking Honda, that that motherfucker gonna still run. Put 180 miles on that bitch right here. Keep that bitch still running. I'm gonna say, can that have anyone ever drove a Rolls Royce that had 180 miles on there? They probably got rid of that bitch as soon as it hit like 50,000. Okay. She's gonna be so mad at Madeline at the end of this. <laughs> I know, dude. How was Madeline feel that? She's getting so friendly with it. It's funny, though. Now that I've settled down, more girls hit on me now than I did when I was single. But it's getting your loyal. Like, around. Sergio and I are gonna come out with a camera. So you got another yeah. Rose Roy. That's why. <laughs> <laughs> if we don't like it, we can just, you know, change it. Yeah. And that's how it be. If she passes the test, which is, do you plan on telling her? 
that this was a test. Or would you? Nah. Some things are better. He not telling her. But this is the first time we ever seen this. Damn. That fun said. I feel it. I feel it. She'll never come across this video. And if she does, remember, guys, you deny, deny, deny. <laughs> 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 Nigga, you in the video. Oh, I'm just so high, I don't even remember. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, he's different. The dance was coming out pretty nice, and so was the sun. After 45 minutes, this is the first time I've ever seen along. someone say uh, they're not telling the person. That's funny. Ooh. What's up? My manager's calling me. Hold up. Hello. Oh, uh, hey, Madeline. You have got some time to talk. Otherwise, your music video might not happen. Yes. Give me one second. Give me one second. I gotta oh. take this. Yeah, yeah. Go ahead. No worries. Hey, okay, I'll be right back. Give me like 10, 15 minutes. She crazy. And just like that, we got Madeline out of there. We were one step closer to Isaiah making his move. She left you for a manager? Yeah. Yeah. You can't tie her down for too long. That girl stays busy. I saw what you guys are doing, though. It's looking good. You like it? Yeah. It's all the little, I, I'm not going to do it. I can't dance. <laughs> How long you been dancing for? Honestly, like my entire life. All righty, Kyle. Go ahead and make your entrance. Over. You uh, you dance full time right now? Yeah, I've been super blessed to get like hella gigs back to back. That's dope. Yeah. So you produce like all of the uh, music? I wouldn't say all of it. We have like 20 something songs together. I produce this track. Really? Yeah. That's fire. Appreciate it. No, she's really good. I think she really does make music though. For real. Don't she? Not as long as most people that I know. Mm. I've only been doing it for like seven years. So it's like, That's yeah. Still a long time. Yeah. It's a lot of work, but yeah. we love it. Yeah. Yeah. It's beautiful. Appreciate it. She real f***ing curious. Been here for like two years. Really? Mm-hmm. You like it here? I love it here. Yeah. Yeah. She, her, the fact that she even entertaining this conversation alone is already a red flag. Ideally, what would you yeah, but, see her do? Yeah, but, I mean, not really. It's the producer, you know what I mean? So she, she dancing to the niggas, to the niggas. What he produced, you know what I mean? So she just not gonna ignore the nigga, you know what I mean? Like in his house. Like what the fuck? That she here for business that ain't got nothing to do with her. Madeline ain't in the room. She's supposed to be minding her business. You think you though? Anything other not than really. Dance, playing sports growing up? Yeah, actually. Yeah. And now it's going What's to up, sports, which is What's, What's happening, bro? How's she looking? Dude, your car still looks fresh, I mean. The car wash was closed, but oh, the inside needs some work. It's a little wet, but works. Cool. So there's a car that's blocking the driveway, the Dodge Charger. Oh, yeah, that's my car. Do you mind if I move it? I'm going to move it in really quickly, and then I'll put the Rolls Royce right behind it. Oh, I can just move it. I got it. I mean, it will be a tight squeeze, if, so I would rather just not any of the cars get scratched, and I'll just do yeah, it. Yeah, you. Perfect. You guys want to come out with me? He does this thing for a living, by the way. You don't exactly. have to. Exactly. I detail cars, <laughs> not manage cars. Madeline convinced Sierra to park in the driveway so that we could force her to come back outside without even trying. Oh, that's smart so as fuck. Need your car key and I'm gonna move it right up. Sierra thinks that Kyle is just driving her car into the garage so that he could then pull in Isaiah's car into the driveway. While technically, yes, this is true, it's not the main reason why we dragged her out here. Perfect, thank you so much. Wait, oh, hold, why didn't they? As I mentioned Okay, earlier, never mind. Kyle is pretending to be I'll his driver who just got his car detailed. That's my baby right there. You like it? Yeah, it looks really nice. The car was supposed to be super clean. Isaiah was supposed to be impressed by Kyle's work and then tip him a generous amount. But because of the rain, it didn't make sense to do that anymore. Funny enough, though, the sun ended up coming out after all. I would say I can take you on a drive, but I don't know if Madeline would be happy if I took you away. So <laughs> we, <laughs> she did leave you, though. I don't know. No, we can hop inside. Yeah. Oh, we can for sure go inside. All right, here we go. Our new plan was for Isaiah to simply invite Sierra to check out the inside of the car, which he Fucking did stars. I got you. Yeah. Appreciate you. Of course, let me get you your key, bro. Damn. She's, she see the car, she choosing already. Isaiah, she hopped right in there, bitch. Sierra into the car. And I didn't notice this at the time, but when she hops into the car, she immediately starts checking herself out. Is she trying to make sure she looks good? Is she just fixing her hair from all the dancing? I don't know. What do you guys think? Is this She's trying to make sure she looks good, maybe. You gotta check yourself. You look good. <laughs> this is insane. 
With Sierra now in the Rolls Royce, there was only one last step in our plan. Isaiah was now free to finally make his move. How do you think she's going see. so far? Yeah. She, she got in the car. That's but everything else was she talking to the producer, bro. It's I mean, it's all business oriented. You know what I mean? But her hopping in the car is something different. You know what I mean? Going thin ice and it's cracking. Yeah, her hopping in that car is something different. Not gonna lie. She still ain't made any actions that she can't come back from, but she's entertaining too much for sure right, right now. Simple now fact right. she's sitting in the car already about enough. I had them do the interior sure. custom made. On the back right here, you can't really see, mm -hmm. but if you push these buttons, yeah. that pops out like that. Ooh, <laughs> yeah. That's nice. This is my second car. I got the other car in the shop. Oh, wow. But I like driving this one. A lot. Nice. This is my baby. Yeah. Is this like your dream car? Or? Oh, for sure. <laughs> yes, yeah, costs way too much to not be my dream car. How much is it? Guess. I don't want any no cars like that. <laughs> Just by looking at it. I would say maybe like a hundred thousand. You say a hundred thousand? Yeah, one hundred thousand. Is it more or less? That is crazy. That's wow. You really said a hundred thousand dollars. That's how you like he. Like, <laughs> am I wrong? I feel it. Now it sounds like he's flexing. Salted. That's. Hey, that's wild. I told you I don't know cars like that. <laughs> it costs four hundred thousand. Yeah. Four hundred thousand. Mm -hmm. No way. Swear to God. It costs that much. Yeah. You're lying. What I gotta lie for? Four hundred thousand dollars. That's literally the price of a house. I never actually thought about it like that. Here we go, here we go. So now Sierra knows the price of the car, which, side note, is actually $475,000 before taxes. And yes, that includes the umbrella. So, uh, Damn. you live far from here? I'm like 40 minutes now. Yeah? Not too far. That's not far at all. Yeah, not too far. Yeah. You got any plans this weekend? I don't know yet. Why? Wrong well, answer. Wrong answer. Wrong answer. <laughs> yeah. Nigga said wrong answer. Be real. Yeah. Be real. I'm in a predicament she right said, now. She said, yeah, be real. What? I got this beautiful woman in my car. Oh. And I feel like I would be dumb not to ask her out on a date. She would be dumb to say yes. <laughs> ask me on a date. I would love to. Well, why do you want to take me out on a date? Because you're beautiful, you're talented, mm. you're sexy. The list goes on. I can keep going if you want me to. Mm. I want someone I can spend my time with, give my time to. He can't sit. Mm. I want to spend my time with you. She don't even know when people lie to her. That's... She making it easy <laughs> for him, too. I'll pick you up in this. I'll have a whole bouquet of flowers in the back. Flowers? I'll make a song for you. A song the whole nine. Yeah. Yeah. All right, bro. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Let's do it. Put your number on my phone. Okay. We can figure. You already out. knew she was gonna go like. Fail already. Damn. Like she ain't pregnant. I was gonna say, is she pregnant? They just look bad. That's what she on. <laughs> that just look... show up. It don't matter if she's showing. Just opening the door, giving them access, that's already enough. This is crazy because Sierra no. is pregnant. She's yeah, pregnant. She's in a relationship with Joe's heart because she wants to be a family. Yet she's over here agreeing to go on dates with other guys. Right. What do you want to eat? Um, honestly, I have no idea. Like, I'm usually pretty indecisive. Oh, we got you, miss. Indecisive. Just pick. You, you pick. She thinks she about to go get uh, a good, food, like, get a good ass meal. I'll pick you up. We she ain't getting shit. Okay. We figure it out on the day, and then after, we can come back, chill. Like come back to here? Yeah. At your crib? At my crib. <laughs> that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. That one hurt. Damn. She 
already. Look at her just choosing though. What the wrong with this? I can make some drinks. I'm actually kind of nice. Hold on, hold on, hold on. If she said yes to drink, this bitch is pregnant. I actually used to be a bartender back in the day. She gonna say kind of nice with it, yeah. Before I started doing this producer thing. No way. Yeah. <laughs> There's no way. Mm -hmm. What do you know how to make? Once again, Isaiah decided to push this phase even further, and this time it seems to be working out for him. I can make whatever you like. Mm. What do you like drinking? Hold on, bro. This bitch got 10 minutes left. Is he gonna make these niggas go on a date? And push your brother? Okay. Are she pregnant? Are we rocking with the tequila? Mm, margaritas. I kill sunrise sometimes. Okay, I already got the pineapple juice and that orange juice in the fridge right now. Oh, so you just ready. Oh, I stay ready. You stay ready, you don't gotta get ready, you feel me? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she's she talking about drinking while she's supposed to be pregnant. Right? right, that's what I'm saying. That's true. That's true, damn, I didn't even think of that. After that, we can she's you know, see where the night goes. Okay. I'll be down with whatever. Yeah, I like being spontaneous. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, like what? I'm done. She don't got no respect for herself. So oh, she's just making it so easy. This was a complete and utter fail. Sierra knows exactly what Isaiah's offering and she knows what she should say. Yet despite having a man and a baby, she still agrees to go on a date with him. It looks like she's looking for a come up. For sure. Hey, All right, where am I picking for up? For sure. You say you live in what area? She's really doing all of this while she's pregnant, dude. That's, that's a crazy thing. Baby, bro. What's she gonna do when the dude finds out she has a baby? I can't even imagine what she'd be doing on a normal house. just really crazy as to think about, like, you really can't just trust people. And that's why I'm glad I did this because this just gave me the confirmation that she ain't loyal for sure. So that gave me more reason to keep my suspicions going of who baby it is. Yeah. It's cool though, bro. And you definitely want to get her tested before you put in any child support or anything. Oh, 100%, dude. 1,000%. 100%, dude. This is heartbreaking, messed up, and sad. Damn. It's sad. For Jozar and the baby. Like, really think about it. Why they do this nigga like that? It's not funny, but why they... Why they... Why they pose this nigga? And why is there... Nigga has a baby picture thing behind it. Definitely heard her These niggas are crazy. Like, no, nah, she, she need to she need to feel me. She need to see <laughs> how I feel now. Nah. No. She clearly too comfortable in the car. She's too comfortable in this environment. I need to yeah. wake her up and bring her back to reality. Her head in La La Land right now. So she really put the streets. Want to confront her in, right there in the car? Or you want her to come back? Oh inside? no, we right to the car. We right can't give car? her a chance to try to lie about it. We gotta uh -huh. catch her right in the attic. Damn it, she's blocked in too. Her car's blocked in, oh, so yeah, she can't go anywhere. Oh, nowhere. I just did it. Let's go. The outcome of this video was unfortunate, but on the bright side though, if Isaiah does end up being the dad, at least it's good to know that he's gonna step up and be there for his kid. I hope you guys have your talkies because you guys already know. This is gonna be good. Damn. She gonna fucking, her heart gonna drop. She ain't even looking. We go. What the f is this, bro? What the f wrong with you? What the f is this? You know what the f this is. Who are the f you talking much about to go on a date with this nigga? What the f going through your hair right now? What? What? Yo. Yo, the emojis be killing me. Yo, who the fuck? These emojis be killing me. What the f is this, <laughs> Yo. Because I can really see her face like that. Like. Hey, fuck. What the f wrong with you? That shit be killing me. What the f is this? You know what the f this is. Who are the f you talking much about to go on a date with this nigga? What the f going through your hair right now? What? Why the f you out here being a f? What's your problem? Yo, can you stop recording me? No, I'm not about to stop recording you. What the f you out here doing? You in his car talking about you about to go on days this down and there? What the f wrong with you? You tripping? You think I'm stupid or something? You look stupid. Nah, I don't look stupid. I just know what the f you got going on and I need a confirmation of that f for real. You oh, tripping, shorty? I'm over this. Nah, what the f you doing? Out of my way. Where the f you going? We're not about to do she, that. She ain't trying going to away. Your problems and no, your responsibilities. I'm not trying to run away. I'm not trying to be in camera, bro. Brady, you shouldn't have been out here being a What the f you doing there? You talk about you're not trying to be on camera. I'm not trying to be out here raising a kid that ain't mine. You want me to be there, be responsible for this kid and be there for this baby? But you out here doing niggas and like that? You got me up. What the f are you talking about? You know what the f I'm talking about? You out here in the car playing crazy with this? You talking about you about to go on dates? And you talking about you about to drink liquor? You got a baby in your belly. You know what that that's gonna do to my kid? What the f is wrong with you? You not thinking with your head or something? I can do whatever the f I want to do. You're not about to do what the f 
This bitch crazy. Why do y'all niggas fuck? For real. Why do y'all niggas give a baby to? For real. This bitch crazy. You want why you got my kid in your belly? Supposedly my baby. <laughs> Bro, you fucking set me up. Yeah, I set you up because you was about to set Obviously. me up for 18 years. About to have me paying child support on. <laughs> that. A kid that's probably what not even. What the are you talking about, bro? I'm talking about you this baby and you. Hiring people to stalk me? No, nah, don't be trying to flip this dog. <laughs> now it's all these. She said, I heard niggas to stalk me. I'm sorry because you could have been one, two, three, four, five niggas before you told me you had this baby in your stomach. You. See, see, this entire thing was basically all a test. We were just trying to help Joe's art find out if you're loyal to him or not. That's why we have all these cameras. <laughs> Fail rolling. tragically. I mean, and clearly, <laughs> we agreed to go on a date with Isaiah. This isn't actually his house. This house is a rental. Wow. Madeline is a singer, but she doesn't really want to make a whole dance and everything for the video. So, like, all that was just made up. Like, you know, we just wasting my time. So, I'm not going to get my money. <laughs> now you know how I feel to get your yeah, time well, wasted. Why the f do you have everyone in our business? I tried to keep it between me and you, but you wanted to involve all these other niggas in our situation. Now I'm just questioning who you was dealing with before you even told me you was pregnant because it might not even be mine. Now I want a paternity test. And well, it's not, it's not yours. It's not your baby. God. Let me just play the a moment, bro. Look at Bo's face. Well, it's not. It's not yours. It's not your baby. He did all this. Why didn't you tell him that before? Oh my God, bro! I fucking hate. Bro, I'm, I'm I'm mad myself. Well, it's. I don't not, like her. I don't even know she. It's not your baby. Yeah. Did you want to hear that? So they my baby. Who kid is it then? I f***ed your best friend. <laughs> your friend. Hey, look. How does look, that look. feel? Oh my God. What is going on? Is she just talking shit or is, or is she dead ass? Is she just mad? Is she just talking shit because she, all this shit's going on or, or yeah? It's not your baby. Yeah. Did you want to hear that? So they my baby. Who kid is it then? I f***ed your best friend. <laughs> I would have stole it right there. Stop playing. I your friend. Hey, look. <laughs> you know when you this is the face when you get. When uh, you know, everyone when you're at your friend's house and his mom giving him an ass whooping and you just sitting there embarrassed for him, that's the face that you get right here. How does that feel? <laughs> Did you want to hear that? Hell yeah. Nah. Your friend. Oh, look. You know we don't even play like that. Don't even say no like that to me before I get him out of here. Nah. nah she jumped in the head, shorty. How about this? She I mean, I know you're worried about getting paid. So how about if I offer you a thousand dollars to go take a prenatal pregnancy test? There's a few clinics. He different. <laughs> Yo, hold on. Imagine a random ass nigga asking you to take a pre date test, bro. Hold on. Nah. You like, Look who are movie. you? But How that, about this? I mean, I know you're worried about getting paid. Yo, so how about if I offer you a thousand dollars to go take a prenatal pregnancy <laughs> test? There's a few clinics. Who are you? <laughs> I'm Joe Zox Frank here, and I'm trying to just get to the truth at this point. My offer to you. Yo, that shit is crazy. Yo, that shit is funny as fuck. Oh my god. Who are you? <laughs> I'm Joe Zox Frank. <laughs> Yo, look at bro. He's, yo, that shit was hilarious. A thousand dollars to go take a prenatal pregnancy test. There's a few clinics. Who are you? 
<laughs> I'm your best friend, man. I'm trying to just get to the truth at this point. Yo. My offer to you is I'll give you $1,000 <laughs> if you agree to go do a prenatal pregnancy test. It's going to cost about $2,000, but I'll cover all of that. You'll get pretty much $1,000 for taking the test. He'll know who's the actual, if he's the father or not. He, and he's looking out, bro. That'll be my best friend forever. Bro, you got to get his contact information. That's the homie. Fuck all that. He's looking up. I fuck with bro. He's cool as fuck. <laughs> wait, wait, what? So you're offering to pay her? I'll give her an extra five thousand dollars. Oh, this nigga. Oh, he's different. He's different. Hold on. He's different. He doing too much. He got the money though. That nigga is different. Others. I give it away. What? So you're offering to pay her? I'll give her an extra five thousand dollars. Five thousand? Oh no, he's chatting. He's chatting. He's chatting. For six grand total. Six grand. So you give her an extra five grand. That's yes. Awesome. Six grand. This came out of nowhere. My man Scott was offering Sierra six thousand dollars to take this thing called a prenatal pregnancy test. Now I didn't know this at the time, but apparently they've developed ways to find out if you're the parent of like a child said. before the baby's even born. Apparently, so as early right. as seven weeks of conception. Imagine I'm right. Jerry and Maury had this. Six grand. Six grand. Six k. You look. You know I'm you over this, bro. I'm over this. You're not gonna do it. Shorty. Just Why are you trying to leave me? He's talking about the paper and everything. Yeah. You can't go nowhere like You're not going to do it? I'm out of here, bro. Are you You're not? Are you stupid? Dom or stupid? There's no way you're leaving, bro. Now I'm really mad at you. I'm trying to leave now when he said he paid for anything. What's your issue, shorty? Come back. Don't you away from your problems now. You lack accountability with everything you do, and now you're trying to run away when the evidence right in front of you. That's your she problem. can't even go nowhere anyway. Camera. You need to find out your morals and your standards. They in the gutter. You see what you? You. You is the problem. Oh, we gotta move the rolls. Hey, yeah, we should move that before she backs into it. Holy. <laughs> let me let me go move this car. She ain't doing that. I left she the, be stupid the to do that. in the car. Yo, class. She was like, just, you. we could just let her go, bro. Cause she, we gonna let her go, but she's still like, you out here choosing. With these niggas, like I'm a, I've been taking care of you from the start of all of this. You got a 6K opportunity. Let let her struggle, bro. Don't rush for nothing. Don't don't let her control that she got going on. She don't run over here. Hey, she might back up into the rolls, bro. She be dumb as hell. Then that 6K ain't even gonna cover. It. Oh, she might back up into that. Keep getting nutted in. You're a oatmeal cream pie. Oh shit, that's crazy. Oatmeal cream pie is insane. Damn, that's tragic. Oh, that's tragic. <laughs> How is that really called an oatmeal <laughs> cream pie? What the? What does that even mean? Oatmeal cream pie. I guess. Hey, what do you mean? What's that be? Put two and two together, nigga. You know what it be. I kind of get it. Yeah. <laughs> What's wrong with her? Now, despite being offered six thousand dollars to yeah, take this prenatal dumb. test, Sierra refused to take it. Why? I don't know. Yeah. Maybe it's because of her ego. Maybe it's because she knows it's not Joe's arts. Or maybe, even if it wasn't, so fucking what? You getting money for that shit? It's because of what she says next. Jokes on you. There's no baby. <laughs> oh my God. <clears throat> bro, I f oh my fucking gosh, bro. Hi. <laughs> what? Yeah, she really just said that. Yeah, I don't know if she was being serious or not, but uh, she just said there was no baby. She just said there's no baby. She said there's no baby. No way. You said you recorded it. You got it on yeah, camera. No. Oh, yeah, we got it. You got to spin that back for me. So you telling me? So you telling? So you telling me that it ain't no baby? There, there is no baby in the first place. Oh yeah, hey, careful. Yo, careful. Joseph, come back fuck? here, Joseph. There's no baby in the first bitch. place. Yeah, don't, don't, don't let her. Yeah, don't you let her. You crazy as What the f is wrong with you? Yeah, she crazy as fuck. You! Take your ass on somewhere. She's weird. Let's see that footage. I want to see that footage. I don't rule out the possibility that there really is no baby, but I don't know. She's super mad. She might just be talking out of her ass. This revelation is shocking, but I kind of take it with a grain of salt. Like, what is even the truth at this point? I don't condone all the, the being thrown out, but... This is why you. She's weird as fuck. You know what? Joke's on you. There's no baby. 
<laughs> she was basically just about to play me. I don't know, bro. Just to try to like get the bread out of me, bro. You think she's being honest there? I don't know. I'm a little pissed. You can't, cause she was saying so much. She she been saying so much shit. You don't know what the fuck. She's hey, been. She's, 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 she only told me about a month or two ago, so I can't even tell by the stomach if she's really pregnant or not. I feel like she was trying to f with you the whole confrontation, cause she she was telling you, oh, the baby's not yours, that right, friend, right. and now she's telling you there is no baby. Yep. I think anything is possible at this point. Right. What does get me is the whole like, why didn't she take the the money? I took That's that what I was I'm like, saying. If she was telling the truth, why wouldn't she just say exactly? That? She's telling the truth. It's, it's grand. Even if she is telling the truth, she's done for in the, in the case of me feeling any feelings for her. Even if she's pregnant and the kid is mine, she just gonna have to learn how to deal with it from a distance. Yeah. I'm co-parenting and I get my kid on my own time. That might have been the craziest one yet. I ain't gonna lie. That might have been the craziest video I've seen. That bitch crazy. She need help. Like, comment, subscribe, share the video. Y'all, y'all, watch y'all be fucking up. For real. Don't get caught up with one of those. You're done for. I'm out, man. I give me a check and I fuck it up. Yeah. Give me a check and I fuck it up. Yeah. Give me a check and I fuck it up. Yeah.